Hi guys, victory over the Decepticons. This will just be a quick captain's log for Friday, October 12th, 2018. Here we go. We're going to stick it and keep it simple. How do you stop the alien invasion that's been planned for gosh knows how long? Very likely longer than real Neo's been around. How do we stop the all lion invasion? <laughs> all lie in. I'll tell you how to stop it. Have more people try to ask NASA and SpaceX how come there are no 360 degree pans from space that involve stars? <laughs> so, you get, we'll say, a thousand miles closer <laughs> to uh, space and you can't see the stars, okay? So that's like saying that you get closer to the World Trade Center in New York City, Manhattan, but oh no, you'll see it less. <laughs> $330 billion a year, guys. Why? 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 There's no 360 degree pans from space, except in the movie Gravity. I guarantee you there'll be more 360, I mean, the whole movie Gravity was 360 degrees. I mean, you know, the whole movie was just nothing but whoa, whoa, and I'll bet the same thing will happen, whoa, 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 with this new Ryan Gosling vehicle called First Man, which is a very interesting point in the 50 plus years of supposed, once again, space travel, there's been no movies about going to the moon. Uh, you can say Apollo 13, but I'm pretty sure they didn't land. This one, they're going to try to say they landed on the moon, and it was the first man, Neil Armstrong. Well, Mr. Neil Armstrong and any other Neil Armstrong, Stanley Kubrick, Dark Side of the Moon, MFers out there, please send me a link or somehow show me and find real Neo a way to see a 360 degree pan from space with stars from official outlets because those official outlets are asking for again 330 billion dollars a year from the United States government something that I feel that we should not be doing or be able to afford so that's my motivation is a better future without deception without laying so many lies around all these lies that you don't live very long and you certainly have no idea where you are and you certainly will never discover the heart realm which that's my my feelings that where we are is why there's no sides there's definitely a top but no one wants to discuss how hey Varner Von Braun left that whole 9-11 thing and his little thing about how strong the firmament is and then you got Bezos going and finding the rockets off the bottom of the ocean. And then third, are you telling me that before I was born, they had the tech to go up to the rock that's floating, rocks floating, what is this, Star Wars? And then they bring back moon rocks, and then all these moon rocks have been analyzed, and oh, well, they're from Arizona, <laughs> or something like that. So again... All I'm asking for with this video is please send me, real Neo, some sort of evidence that space travel exists. There's 27,000 satellites up there bouncing around. And I don't need George Clooney or Sandra Bullock or Ryan Gosling. I need a person who is accepting the $330 billion a year for their existence. And no, I'm not talking about young Sheldon. No, I'm not talking about the... Big Bang Theory actors talking about a person that can actually show some logical sense of a camera pan from space with stars. Not one big spotlight like the Tesla to the moon thing. The Tesla, oh my goodness. Again, hey, frat boys, calling all frat boys. That might be what I label this. Show me some proof and then we can go somewhere because again I want to create a better Dharma a Dharma without Decepticons because I see Decepticons as the biggest weakness here in the heart realm they just lie and then they lie again and then they lie on top of that and then they lie on top of that that is not proper leadership people think with your heart follow your heart 
and not the 17 inches up here where everything is just crazy. Show me a 360 degree pan and then we're on cooking like bacon. Victory over the Decepticons right here. I love you guys. Real Neo out. And say hi there, Fancy. Hi, Fancy. <laughs> yes, that's a good girl. And piss on you, jerk. <laughs>